general relativity step by step. I'll develop this equation here, which is true in a local inertial frame, in an elevator frame, for the riemann christoffel tensor with four downstairs indices. And now what I'm going to do is play with this, and I'll show you why it's, uh, why it's a good thing. Uh, I'm going to make the observation that R alpha, well, I'm going to think about, I've got R, I've got this, and I'm going to think about R beta alpha. I'm going to swap the first two indices and see what happens. Um, well, if I swap alpha and beta over, that, this term here turns into this term here. You see there's a beta and an alpha and an alpha and a beta. So these two terms swap identities. And similarly, these two terms swap identities because alpha and beta turn into alpha there and beta there. And the metric tensor is symmetric. So all that happens is it changes sign. So R alpha beta mu nu equals minus R beta alpha mu nu. Now I've established that that's true in a local inertial frame, but because this is a valid tensor equation, this is true in any reference frame. True in any frame. Which is quite nice. So let me just go through the whole of this again. I've got the riemann christoffel curvature tensor uh, here. And what I'm doing is I'm coming up with a relationship which is true in an inertial frame, which I did by choosing this nice, neat, clear um, metric tensor, found, established that the tensor itself was, uh, sorry, that the expression itself in local inertial, in a local inertial frame was anti-symmetric in alpha and beta. But by the comma goes to semicolon rule, there aren't any actual, well, there are differentials in here, I guess. But by the comma goes to semicolon rule, we can deduce that this equation here is true in any reference frame, which is quite a powerful result. So it means that it, we only got, um, well, in, in particular, we know that something like R11 mu nu equals zero because it equals minus R11 with the ones written the other way around, I guess, mu nu. So they, they must be both equal to zero. So that's, that's quite a nice thing. And I'm going to develop some more in uh, subsequent screencasts. Stop there.